I am Dr. K. S. N. Jyoti, Assistant Professor at Department of Genetics and Biotechnology, Women's College, Koti. It is indeed a great pleasure to see a good response for the video that we have recently uploaded on indoor oxygen plants. I thank all the viewers for the wonderful suggestions and comments given. And as promised, we are here back with another indoor plant for of this series. The rejuvenating aura created by plants is what makes them a best choice to enhance the aesthetic beauty of our homes. And the strongest, the fastest growing of all these indoor plants is money plant, technically called as pothos, belonging to the family of Eresi. Its botanical name is Epipremnum aurum. It's called as money plant probably because the young leaves of this plant resemble the coins of the olden age. Many people believe that money plant brings lot of prosperity and good luck. But scientifically, let me tell you, money plant is a wonderful air purifier. It helps in removing almost all organic indoor pollutants like benzene, xylene, formaldehyde. Belonging to the family of Eresi, money plant is also a succulent plant having thick leaves. So as I already mentioned in the last video, these plants of succulent nature give oxygen 24 by 7. That makes our money plant a favorite choice for people who wish to grow them indoors in any corner of the house. Pothos is a perennial evergreen plant which grows very lushly if left in outdoor spaces. But when we are growing them indoors, generally the plant grows up to 6 to 7 centimeters and it is very well and easily maintained. You can grow money plant in any kind of a pot, whether it is a clay, terracotta, uh, or you can grow them in plastic, ceramic, porcelain, you name any kind, big, small, large, wide, you can grow them in any kind of a pot. You all must be knowing it that money plants not just grows in soil, but it grows very comfortably in water also. You can guess, just get a small stem cutting and put it in water and because the plant grows with aerial roots, it can comfortably grow in water also. The only difference when you are growing money plant in water or soil is the plant that is growing in water will have very soft tender leaves compared to the one that is growing in soil. Remember, never change the medium in which you are growing a money plant. If you have first put it in water, let it grow in water because the plant will get acclimatized to that medium and it will start developing roots there. If you want to grow it in soil, plant it directly in soil and let it grow there. Money plants, when they start growing, they will need little more water compared to an uh, adult plant. So in the initial stages that you brought a money plant home, start watering it for almost one week continuously with little water and later you can water them once a week depending upon the dryness of the soil. The instructions to grow this money plant in your indoors is don't water it very frequently and never put your money plants in direct sunlight because the leaves will get wilted and faded if you put them in sunlight. There are many varieties of money plants that are commonly available in India. Let me introduce few such important varieties of money plants to you today. The most common variety of money plant popularly grown everywhere is called as golden pothos because the leaves of this particular plant have certain golden shade with yellow lines. This is what we see that's grown commonly in our balconies and on the walls of many office spaces also. The other variety is called as marble queen. Now the name marble indicates that the leaves have a, a kind of a variegated look. Variegated means differently colored. In marble queen variety, you will see the leaves having a creamy color with different shades. But the problem with marble queen is it needs little more maintenance compared to the golden pothos. And if you want to retain the cream shade of the leaves, you have to sometimes expose it to sunlight, other, unlike the other varieties of money plants. So for if you want an easier choice of money plant to grow indoors, go for the other variety called marble king. The difference between a marble queen money plant and a marble king money plant is in marble king, the leaf has uh, white and uh, yellow shades unlike the creamy look of the queen variety. And marble king is a wonderful choice 
for people who want to keep it in the darker corners of the houses it can grow anywhere and uh, because of the variegated look marble king gives a very nice uh, amazing look to the center tables or to the uh, dining table or in the kitchen you put it anywhere it will add a lot of beauty the other common variety is called as a big leaf money plant this you must be very commonly seeing everywhere in the gardens on the walls and it has that nice big green leaves and when i say green there is another variety called as a jade money plant jade the color refers to the dark green variety this also has le green leaves the difference between a big green money plant and a jade money plant is in the size of the leaves big green money plant has big leaves in jade the leaves are green but not very big again jade money plants need little more maintenance compared to the big green money plants so the general choice uh, is a big green money plant the last most beautiful variety of the money plants is called as a neon money plant the leaves of these neon money plants have a very deep golden yellow shade giving it a neon like appearance and this makes a wonderful choice when you want to put it on your office table because the plant grows nice bushy and when you keep it on uh, as i said office table it adds a lot of beauty to it all varieties of these money plants can be grown in hanging pots and you can see that the falling foliage of these money plants uh, give a wonderful look uh, to your indoor spaces when you put them in hanging pots that's what makes money plant best choice as indoor plants money plant is popularly called so people believe that growing money plant indoors can bring in a lot of luck and prosperity there is no scientific evidence for it but it is suggestive sometimes that each stem of a money plant has five leaves indicating the five elements of nature so as per vastu and feng shui people suggest growing a money plant indoors adds a lot of aesthetic and spiritual values to your house all of you choose your favorite variety of money plant depending on where you want to put it let me repeat you want to put it in your balconies choose a golden pothas you want to put it in your living room go for a marble king you want to put it on your office table go for a neon money plant you want to keep it as a support on your outdoor walls go for a big green money plant choose your variety and grow them comfortably in indoors and breathe fresh air and add aesthetic beauty to your homes thank you and please leave any suggestions and comments below